Hello, Princess Casserole here, and I am here with a small jewelry bag unbagging. Um, this I got from a thrift store. It was actually um, the hearts for the homeless here, and this one was $5.99 for the bag. And I saw one thing that I really wanted in here, um, but I think there might be some other nice things in there as well. So again, I did pay $5.99 for this. Um, wasn't on sale or anything. One of the things that I saw was this brooch and it's Monet. And it is a star brooch and there really isn't much finish wear at all. Let's see. I'll try to close it. Yeah, it looks like it's closed here. So this is a really nice brooch. It's pretty big. Um, these two things I thought looked nice too. This was an, I think, dyed pink abalone bangle. So it's nothing too amazing, but um, I thought it was nice, and these are nice, you know, stacked up with other ones as well. This one was nice too. Um, I don't think there's any markings in here either, but this one, I liked that it was like a rose gold color, and it'll be nice, you know, for stacking. And then this one is a wood necklace. And that one's pretty nice, you know, kind of 70s. Um, it seems like it's a little wonky from probably being in there. And there was this in there. And that's wearing away, so um, it won't be keeping this one. Uh, this one, Elsie, Liz Claiborne. Um, let's see. I thought this one was broken, but I guess not. Let's see, I don't see any wear or anything. Uh, see, that's why, because there's another jump ring here. I think it is broken. There was another one there. So, now I did see this and was kind of surprised by the signature. It's Avon. But um, I thought this was really cute because I, you know, live in the city of Buffalo. So, I thought that would be a nice little necklace. This Avenue. This one is broken. So. La. But I usually see a mix of broken and not broken in these things. Um, this one is not broken. This was also one that I saw that had me stumped because in here it says 925, you know, in the the um, groove but I thought this was something totally different from the ends you know if you saw this and I saw it was silver I'm like oh okay and then <laughs> it, it was not what I thought it would be um, you know it could totally just be glass because there's pink yeah it's probably glass dolphins but I thought that was different. Let's see. Now we have this one. Doesn't seem to be any marks on it or anything. Uh, just a heart necklace. Looks like some of the finish is wearing away and some of the things are missing. So that one goes in the broken pile. This one's not terrible. Stretchy bracelet, but um, it's not broken <laughs> and it, it's somewhat fashionable so so this is really light and um, cheap 
so that one will probably go in my donate pile. I don't donate the broken stuff normally um, to like this one. We'll also go in the donate pile. Y-O-U-S-I? Hmm. Never heard of that before. This is definitely different. And then there's this. Um, this is probably homemade. It's using old sewing things for the clip. Really beautiful, like Murano style with the adventurine and the caps. And I have a bracelet that I paid too much for that is a lot like this. So I thought these were just really gorgeous. And, you know, they're knotted in between. You can see that here, that beautiful color. But this is very pretty too. It's got the, like, copper adventurine. It seems to be really well made. There's no sharp edges or anything like that. I see a lot of these, but this is one of the nicer pieces. I think this could look gorgeous on the right necklace. So that is very nice. And a spare earring wire. Um, 925. Then there is... Just this heart. I don't see any markings. I don't think it's silver or anything like that. But it is, it's a cute, cute um, bracelet. And it's a pendant uh, filigree. I don't know if this is a real pearl or not. And it's old, you know, a little older. Definitely vintage. Again, this is definitely worth it. These are like older style beads. They're glass. Um, I think they're probably made in Italy. This is quite nice too, actually. I don't always appreciate these. Um, and that is nice. And these two are nice. And, you know, I I think this looks very, what do you think, 80s, 90s to me. Silver. But um, there certainly could be somebody out there that would like this, that really loves dolphins. And the Monet brooch, I think, is beautiful. And this Avon Buffalo, I love too. So that one was nice. Like I said, I, I do love the, the wood. Um, actually, unrelated, I just picked this one up. And it's got wood with like the brass in it. And... Um, I just love these two, so kind of a sucker for the wood jewelry. So, and this I need to look up because I have never heard or seen anything quite like this. <laughs> this one I think is a winner. I honestly prob probably would have paid the $5.99 just for this. So, and I'm glad to see it's not broken. I don't see any damage to it. And, um, I'm excited about it. I'll have to show you guys the bracelet that I got that pretty much matches this. It, they're just, they're so gorgeous, these beads. So, all right, that is it. I really wanted to open this bag just 
so I could get some of this stuff out. So thank you very much for watching and please leave any comments down below. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already and hit the notification bell. Hopefully I will go on live soon. I keep promising. I apologize that I haven't yet and hit the like button. I probably already said that, but <laughs> I will see you in my next video. Have a wonderful day.